Hi there guys, welcome to another Bible video. Um, today we have got the Amico Dehumidryer. Uh, it's not Dehumidifier, it's Dehumidryer. Dehumidryer, Dehumidryer. <laughs> anyway, this is a very powerful piece of equipment. Um, with this machine you can basically replace a tumble dryer for drying your clothes indoors. Um, and it's actually very energy efficient because the higher you set the power, the less energy it, it uses. Um, that's because of the DC inverter motor uh, inside. Um, it's actually so good, um, it's actually the best um, dehumidifier in, in a Mika range. Um, and as such, Miko have made a part of their uh, platinum range. So um, uh, it's actually fairly expensive, but it's very, very good. Um, um, I'd, I'd, I'd actually highly recommend it. Um, but uh, I suppose that's that's Miko, um, like with the Miko Zambezi, Zambezi. Jeez, it's um, a, a beautiful piece of uh, machinery. The uh, same with this. Um, it, uh, it extracts 25 liters according to the packaging, but Miko themselves have, have said that at um, a temperature of 20 degrees Celsius and 60% relative humidity, uh, this unit will extract 11 liters. Um, but um, it's, it's perfect, perfect for drying washing indoors um, during the winter. Um, so basically the harder it works, the more moisture it pulls out of the air, but the lower the energy uh, uh, you should goes. <laughs> you you know what I mean. You, you know what I mean. Um, it's also a, a automated de dehumidifier. Uh, you can basically press a button um, and it will regulate the humidity level itself. Um, it aims for about fifty percent, so you can just set it. Leave it, walk away, go shopping, go dancing, <laughs> uh, and uh, it'll bring the the uh, the humidity level down to fifty percent. If the humidity level rises, it, it'll work harder to 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 bring it back down. Um, it's actually also uh, fairly fairly quiet. Um, in fact, there's a a quiet mode, um, and I think the decibels is about forty two decibels. Um, and this is a a compressor dehumidifier, uh, which are normally louder than desiccant um, dehumidifiers. And forty two decibels is actually very very good for not only for a a compressor dehumidifier but a dehumidifier of this size. Um, now um, I'm six three. Uh, and, and, and my hands are big, and, and you can just see the 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 size of this. Um, but at the same time, it's actually much smaller than a a, a tumble dryer, uh, and it's much much cheaper as well. Um, and this is actually Europe's first DC inf inverter dehumidifier. Um, so it's um, another sp a special piece of technology from Miko. <laughs> um, some of the features are that um, it's got a 5 litre water bucket at the front here uh, which just pulls out uh, just like this and just here is a is a handle which which pops up and down and so, so uh, and a uh, lid which uh, uh, you can just uh, take off anything what, what I'd like to is the the, the see-through plastic here so you can actually watch the the water water level rise um, and then you can empty the tank before it fills up. Um, so that's the water tank. Let's put that here. Um, and then you have a nice shapely here. Um, I'll talk about the, the, the control panel in a second. This is the side. Nice. Uh, nice uh, uh, curve. Um, then here um, is a very important part of the uh, dehumidifier, the, the filter. And the filter just pops off like this. So hoover or wipe. Uh, and then you should just be able to put, put it back just like that, easy peasy. Uh, and then here you have the the continuous drainage plug. Uh, this basically goes in there, and this this is there, and it, it, it bypasses the 
the the water tank um, and this is the hose. Um, so you can you can also use use this machine on boats and in sheds and caravans and motorhomes and anyway. Um, so that's that. Um, and also uh, there's a handle at the back. Uh, which you can lift it up. It's it, it's it's actually fairly heavy. It's about 15, 15 kilos, I think. Um, but uh, underneath, um, as, as you're able to see, it's got a um, uh, caster wheels, uh, which is which is great. Uh, so it's handy for transportation from room to room. So uh, we'll just have a quick look at a, at a control panel. This actually is a, is the adjustable louver, uh, where, where where all the hot air blows out. Um, so uh, you can you can wash you can dry your washing faster with that. Um, so basically, the the control panel. Um, you have your on off button. You have your mode button. Uh, there's about maybe four modes: um, humidity stat mode, your laundry mode, your quiet mode, and your auto mode. Um, and um, uh, you can read the review below to to read more about them because um, I, I sort of don't want to make this this video too long. Uh, and then this is your your, your fan button, uh, so so you can you can select one of three speeds. Uh, this is your uh, turn lock button. Uh, just uh, 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 push it in, hold it down for three seconds, um, and then uh, all of the buttons become protected from small hands. Uh, who think it's fun to to push all the buttons? Uh, this is your louver button. Um, you can you can turn the the louver on or off. Uh, so so um, open or close. Your ionizer, um, which is a, a great little feature. Uh, your humidity setting and your 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 timer. Uh, and the timer lasts for between an hour and. In 12 hours. Um, so that's basically it. Um, I just wanted to do a, a quick re review of it uh, of the Miko 25 liter dehumidryer. Dehumidryer. <laughs> it's always a fun word to say, dehumidryer. But it's a fantastic piece of kit. Fantastic. Um, lots of uh, smart technology inside, uh, which is normally used in high end air conditioners. Um, much much cheaper than a a tumble dryer. Um, I'd say I'd say if you're using it with about 250 watts, if you're paying maybe 15 cents per per, per kilowatt, what's that? So half of that is seven and a half, uh, 3.75. Uh, uh, yeah, um, it'll cost about 3.75 pence to run per hour, uh, which is not bad. So you could basically dry a load of washing for about 10 or 15 pence or maybe a, a small bit more, all depending on the size of, of your room um, that you're, 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 you're drying your clothes in. Anyway, that's it. Um, just maybe click on the review below uh, to, to read an in-depth in um, review. Um, and don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you all in the next video. Okay, see you later.